Tired of dealing with annoying flies, fruit flies, and gnats in your home? The Zevo Flying Insect Trap is your ultimate solution. Don't wait. Check out the link in the video description now to get your Zevo Flying Insect Trap on Amazon and enjoy a bug-free home today. Angry Brit holidaymakers have vowed to boycott Turkey after the Turkish government introduced a controversial law culling stray dogs. The animal-loving holidaymakers have promised to cancel their holidays to the popular tourist destination over its dog massacre laws. Videos shared on social media have shown numerous mass graves of dogs rounded up and killed by people hunting the animals after the legislation was passed in July. Across social media, users said they had canceled their trips to Turkey. One person said, Turkey was on my 2025 list to visit. It's a beautiful country. The people who love dogs must be heartbroken. It comes as thousands of people have taken to the streets to protest the cruel law, with signs reading you cannot kill them and take back the law. The heartbreaking massacre law is designed to take dogs off the street and house them in shelters, however, a clause in the heartbreaking law states any dog that displays aggression or is sick will be put down. A UK-based animal charity is working to save stray dogs in Turkey. According to the BBC, the Happy Paws Puppy Rescue Shelter cooperates with Pounds in Turkey to rehome stray dogs in the UK. Lisa Smart, of the Happy Paws charity, said, It's just staggering to think that these little souls, who are very trusting, very sweet, will be rounded up, taken away. Ms. Smart's rescue center in Turkey has just had to find extra space to take in 21 dogs, all golden retrievers, on top of the 55 currently there. She is concerned about the cost of looking after and rehoming so many animals. In September, the charity is bringing 13 dogs to Lewis, East Sussex, where they will be given to new owners. Turkey is thought to be home to around 4 million strays and they are a frequent sight in many areas. The controversial legislation was passed at the end of July and introduced due to concerns about rabies, dog attacks and the animals causing accidents. Animal rights activists have called instead for neutering campaigns to be stepped up, and the opposition Republican People's Party, CHP, said it would appeal against the legislation in the Constitutional Court. CHP leader Osgar Ozel said, The bill is clearly unconstitutional and does not defend the right to life. We will do more than what is required of us in terms of building more shelters, vaccination, neutering and adoption. However, the Turkish government has insisted strays will not be killed for no reason. Ibrahim Yamakli, Minister of Agriculture and Rural Affairs said, This is not a massacre law, this is an adoption law. This is not a massacre law, this is an adoption law, said the Agriculture and Rural Affairs Minister Ibrahim Yamakli. Meanwhile, Turkish President Recep Tayyip Erdogan said, We have a stray dog problem that does not exist in any developed country. He added, Despite the opposition's provocations and campaigns based on lies and distortions, the National Assembly once again listened to the people, refusing to ignore the cries of the silent majority. Turkey approved a controversial new law dubbed the Massacre Law to deal with stray dogs on the streets of Turkey at the end of July. It comes amid concerns about attacks, road accidents, and rabies. The new legislation requires municipalities to collect stray dogs and house them in shelters to be vaccinated, neutered and spayed before making them available for adoption. Dogs that are in pain, terminally ill, or pose a health risk to humans will be euthanized.